All right, let's find the mean by using the leveling out method. We're given the data 4, 4, 5, 5, 2. One way we could think about this and visualize it is to think about five students, A, B, C, D, and E, and think of the numbers as say, number of pencils they have in their desks, right? So student A has four pencils. Student B has four pencils. Student C has five. Student D has five. And student E has two. Now, what the leveling out method is, is everyone getting their fair share. So if we were going to make it so that all students in class had the same number of pencils, right, then we would take, we would have student D take one and give it to E. And we would also have student C take one and give it to you, E, so that now everyone has four pencils. All right, so using the same idea of the leveling out method to find the mean, we can easily find the mean of this data, 72, 70, 68, 69, 71, and 70 by borrowing from one group. Say we'll take two from this one and we'll add it to this one. And we could take one from this one and add it to this one. And you can easily see that the mean is 70 when we just scrape a level right across and push the high peaks into the low valleys.